It's time for another edition of First Responder Friday. This week, we introduce you to Officer Drew Longshore, a traffic officer with the Myrtle Beach Police Department. News 13's Melissa Meyer shares his story. Everything's a challenge, keeps you on your toes, keeps you thinking, and that's what I enjoy. Three years with Highway Patrol and two so far with Myrtle Beach Police. Traffic officer Drew Longshore has a passion for serving the public and protecting people out on the roads. I'm always like a problem solver. I like trying to figure things out. Uh, sometimes things are super cut and dry. Sometimes you really got to put your thinking cap on and, and that's what I enjoy. Being out on the roads and responding to different calls means that no day is ever the same. And whatever needs the community may have, Longshore is always happy to help. I love responding to the calls because everything's unknown. But sometimes the unknown can mean seeing someone hurt, something he says is the most difficult part of the job. You know, I never like seeing people hurt. Anytime I'm out here, especially enforcing traffic laws, I like being able to slow people down on the road, enforcing seatbelt laws, preventing DUIs, things like that, so that we can keep our uh, tourists and our residents here in the city safe. Longshore says one of his biggest accomplishments so far in his career are his DUI numbers. He says he's good with DUI detection and getting impaired drivers off the roads. That's a, a problem that I think every law enforcement agency across the United States faces is impaired drivers. So really being able to pick out those drivers on the roadway, get them off of the roadway and keep all the people on our roadway safe. Looking to the future, Longshore would like to get promoted, but for now, he says he's enjoying working for the traffic unit. It makes it easy to come to work every day knowing, like I said earlier, that you have a great team of individuals and uh, support from leadership that encourage you to go out there and be proactive and, and make the city a safe place. Reporting for News 13, I'm Melissa Myers.